Federal authorities executed a search warrant on the office of Senator Alvin Williams here at the Irby Otley Legislative Hall on Wednesday. FBI, U.S. Marshal Service, and several other federal agencies arrived here a little before noon and have been here for several hours. Meanwhile, lawmakers say they're not sure what the search is in relation to. Senator, anything you could tell us about what's going on inside? I have no idea. No one came to me, so I FBI spokesman Harry Rodriguez says agents executed a search warrant as part of an investigation, but would not go into detail. The Criminal Investigative Division of the Internal Revenue Service, DEA, the Virgin Islands Police Department, and the U.S. Marshal Service are executing a search warrant at the, le or at the legislative building located in St. Thomas, U.S. Virgin Islands. However, I'm not confirming or denying the fact that this warrant is being executed at the office of Senator Alvin Williams. While the FBI would not confirm the search of Senator Williams' office, Majority Leader Senator Celestino White did. Apparently, the federal uh, investigators, the U.S. Marshals and members of the FBI today came into the legislature building specifically to, to do a search of one office within the legislature. Well, mainly two offices. Uh, they were armed with a search warrant that was specific to search the office of Senator Alvin Williams and to also go in and search uh, the office of the MIS, which is the brain, the computer brain of the legislature. So we, obviously it appears as though they wanted to do some forensic uh, look at the computer system within that specific office. No other office of the legislature has been affected. No other individual of the legislature have been affected. We, I as a law enforcement person myself, know that if in fact a court, a judge sign a warrant for a search, that's legitimate. And in truth and in fact, the federal individuals have a legitimate warrants to search a specific place. The legislature will not stand in the way, will not obstruct in any way through senators and his employees that investigation. Senator White and Williams were in St. Croix for a government operations, energy and veterans affairs meeting. They flew back immediately after hearing about the search. I was asked by the president to return back to St. Thomas and so now I am here. Senator Alvin Williams at the time that this occurred was also on the island of St. Croix. As to the whereabouts of Senator Williams, News 2 was unable to make contact. According to Senator White, Williams had no clue what the feds could have been looking for. He's shocked and surprised and he would like to know uh, exactly what is the reason, what is the purpose of uh, his office being uh, search specifically the computer system in his office. He told me he received information from staff members that is, is a computer system within the office that the federal investigators was interested in. In an effort to clear up rumors of a shutdown of the Senate building, White implored members of the media to come inside. We gained access for the first time since the search began at around 3.30. While it seemed to be back to business as usual, one office remained off limits. Natafa Romaine, News 2.